Missing You is a series of 24 short poems um, and this sequence is the first poetry that I'd written since the death of my husband Peter Redgrove in the summer of 2003. Missing You 1. This year no one will ask how you voted or if you know the way to town. No one will call you as an eyewitness or teach you how to train a bird of prey. No one will bring you your new scientist, try to sell you double glazing, or tell you their secrets. People will write to you, but you won't answer their letters. The High Sheriff of Mistletoe will never catch your eye again. No one will peel apples for you, or love you more than you can bear. No one will forget you. 2. I wept in Tesco, Sainsbury's and in Boots, where they gave me medicine for grief. But I wept in Asda, in Woolworths and in the library, where they gave me books on grief. I wept in Clark's, looking in vain for shoes that would stop me weeping. I wept on the peace march and all through the war. I wept in Superdrug, where they gave me a box of tissues. I wept in the churches, the empty, empty churches. I wept in the House of Commons. They voted me out of office. Three. I can't cry anyone's tears except my own. Can't teach anything but my own ignorance. I can only fall from my own mountain, ledge by ledge. I can't rival the wasp's sting or sew except with my needle. Like a salt water wife, I prize open the oyster of my loss. Hoik out the pearl of your death. 4. The rainbow is not enough, nor the flood. My eye can't see enough, nor my ear absorb sufficient silence. January is not enough nor June. Books are not enough, nor the El Grecos. Christianity is not enough, nor Judaism. China is not enough, nor India. Good luck is not enough, nor absolution from the bad. Jasmine is not enough, nor the rose. Kingdoms are not enough, nor the oldest city in the world without you. Five. I used to be a planet, you discovered me. I used to be a river, you travelled to my source. I used to be a forest, you ran away to me. I used to be the sky, you traipsed up mountains to touch me. I used to be a moon, you saw by my light. I was hot coals, you held me. I used to be an atom, you split me. I was music. You often sang me. 6. Like a tough Polish soldier, you put your clean shirt on wet. Like a rainbow without rain, you troubled the sky. You were my sower, sowing wide, my cue dans la bouche. You loved top-knotted Islamic angels with their steep wings of gold and blue. You preferred astronomers' weather, sciences of the birds. You were a prayer across the Orinoco, a Tiber fitting me to perfection. 7. The sky knows everything about you, but won't tell. My questions vanish to the southwest. The sky knows something about you, but keeps silent. My inquiries turned back on the tide. The moon knows all about you, but won't speak for a thousand years. The world, knowing all about you, swings away on its axis, not beating about the beautiful bush. I bide my time, just as you warned me I would. 8. 
I've forgotten everything the sun and moon taught me. Perhaps they were not so wise. The world was so small I hid it in my heart like a woman pregnant before she was born. I've forgotten what a painter of portraits does with a brush, what a musician does with tone and semitone, what a gardener does with a seed. Forgotten that fire burns, grief's disbelief never ends. 9. Don't bring me the sea or clouds or those packs of trees. Don't bring me night or stars or forthright moons or the solitude of the river. Take away that farmyard of Cyclamen, your flooded side street. Don't bring me the sun, leave it where it is. Don't offer me operas or banknotes, spiderwebs peppered with dew. I don't want a bullfight or a cushion you've worked yourself. I don't want anything except the past. Bring me five years ago, last winter, the week before last, yesterday. 10. I make my home in your absence. Take your smallest hope and make it grow. I wake to the dusk of everywhere as if assisting at my own birth or arriving in a country where all the rivers settle down to be ice. 11. World was one word. I could not guess it. World was one gesture. I could not copy it. World was one question. I couldn't answer it. World was one song. How could I sing it? World was one forest, I couldn't fell it. World was one bridge, how was I to cross it? 12. You're a tree's guess, a cloud's confidence, the continent of January, the solitude of a comet, a world without a wren. You're the heart of when, the pulse of where, sleepy as a motorway, eager as an earthquake, elusive as an elegy, daring as dusk. You invent your own exit via the black economy of poetry. 13. My tamer of doves, my alphabet of the moon, fall of night, harvests welcome, the grief of day, my blind man and my seer. Dreamer against his will, my furious saint, warrior of peace. 14. I won't find you in the feather bed of thought or in the blip of the city. To find you, I must be the bloodhound of love, block capitals of the rain, swift and slow at once, because you'll be everywhere I'm not. Suddenly, I'll be there beside you, as if all the time you'd only been four streets away. 15. I'm the leopard changing my spots, the horse led to water I must drink, the elephant who forgets, a silk purse sewn from the sow's ear. I'm the long, long road with no turning, the cloud without a silver lining. Mine is the last straw that mends the camel's back, sails us both through the needle's effortless eye. 16. Think of me as a small backward country appealing for aid from the far-off first world. Imagine the dirt of my shrines, the riddle of my dry rivers, the jinx of my cities. When you hold the full purse of autumn, or celebrate the nativity of a pair, picture me as the hawk of spring, a one-pupil school, the safekeeper of sunrise. Think of me without you, stuck here forever between rainless May and the drought of June. 17. Your name didn't change after your death. Many others also answered to it. 
After your death, the climate didn't change, the government stayed calm. Waterfalls remembered you forever, remaining loyal, looking for you everywhere, storm after storm, teacup after teacup. 18. Autumn fans its tail without you, and spring bears its burden alone. Summer, that small supernatural being, manages without you, and winter closes your many doors. Like an interval between kings, the year is a confusion of reds and golds, but in the gulag of August, days are where you left them, nights the same. 19. Are you visiting the harems of April, travelling the great world of May? Are you researching the archives of June? Do the rains of July grieve you? Are you saluting the landslides of August, the independence of September? Are you in unarmed combat with October? Does November please you? Is December your new best friend? Are you hunting that grail, January? Do you still have time for February? Have you seen March celebrating the marriage of green and blue? 20. We were our own seraphs. Ours came and went in the name of the East. All trees were the product of our love. Every bit of woodland listened to us. Ours was the tabernacle of light, the sun our sphinx of the air. We signed the electoral register of our hearts, voting ourselves into office again and again. 21. I've lived with your death for a year, that despot death, that realist. Stunned as if I've just given birth to a foal, or made an enemy of the rain. All at once you had more important things to do than to live. Death is the feather in your cap, the source of your fame, my darkest lesson. This dropout year closes. I begin my second year without you, just me and the paper-thin world. 22. The TV asks me, how long after being widowed before you start dating? When China tours the world by rowing boat, when India is small as Ireland, when that unbeliever water turns to wine. 23. I'm letting go of you year by year. Today it was 1970, tomorrow it may be 1977. There is so much of you, you will never completely cease. But slowly, I'm releasing some of you from me. There's no rush, no deadline. Time doesn't matter. It's just that I can't despair forever. So I pour you away from me, libation by libation, as if discarding the water from the font at Manakam, in which an infant has just been baptised. 24. A world's daylight was not enough to keep you here, nor the night's secret of success. Summer will never forget you, nor friendly autumn. They'd stop at nothing to keep you here, where you belong. Every afternoon reads between the lines for news of you and on the spur of the moment evening welcomes you who are never there. Next week knows his fatherland is too small for you and next year knows it too. No city working till late at night could keep you nor the happy endings of the sea. The theatre sold out every night couldn't hold you, nor the long disobedience of the truth. Today, who is a shadow of his former self, 
lets you go, and so do I. All my schools closed for summer, silent for weeks.